so guys you've been wondering why you get a pop-up that says um and it's first profile already active ne? so in this video i will explain how you are getting it and why you are getting it and how to solve it ne? so the first thing that you need to do is you need to go to my nsfast page then this one is the login page to your student portal ne? so most of the people they are going to complete registration so when you go to complete registration you will be asked to enter your id number this page this page is only for those who registered their profile and their profile is not yet active therefore they will need to come to complete registration enter their id number therefore nsfast is going to send one time pin to their mobile number and an email address to activate their profile so if you enter your id number like this then you click submit therefore you see this um dialogue message this message it means that you already have a profile you already have an account with nsfast to solve this you just need to go back to the login page enter your email address there sign in therefore apply from there so if you're getting this message just know you already have a profile you cannot um create another in another profile or account so the only solution here guys is just go back to log in therefore from the login page enter your email address there your password therefore sign in this it this this it, it's happening to all the people who have an account maybe someone who applied the last day then now they don't remember their password so they think when going to registration complete registration is going to solve their problem the only solution is to sign in with your password and your email address then if you don't remember those two credentials and then you need to go to forgot password then under forgot password you'll enter your uh your id number and then you verify then after verifying then you need to answer this question then from there you'll be taken to this uh forgot your username and password page then from here again you need to enter your id number then select the option um either username or password if you don't remember your email address you can just click i can't remember my username therefore they will send the email address to this mobile number ne? and again if you if you can't remember your password then they, they will send the link to a mobile number and the email address you use to create this um account so what you can do now is just log in then apply yes uh if you have any question you can comment in the video description therefore i will answer you guys so if you liked this explanation please consider subscribing to the channel and like the video